syphilis, secondary syphilis, that is S. So Coxsackie A, Rickettsia, and syphilis. These three diseases that can cause rash on your palm and soul, including including palm and soul. So there will be rash all over your body, including palm and soul. So in palm and soul, only three diseases have rashes. You drive cars using your palm and soul. So that is the way to remember. Coming back to typhus, again typhus, that is the endemic typhus that is caused by Rickettsia typhi. This is the bacteria's flea, that is rat flea. In epidemic typhus, that is caused by the Rickettsia pravazaki and the bacteria's human body loss. There, rash starts centrally and spread out, sparing the palm and soul. So, other epidemic typhus and endemic typhus, the rash appear on the trunk and then they will spread peripherally. This is a centrifugal, not centripetal, and they will not cause rash on your palm and soul. So, you can differentiate between Rocky Mountain and typhus, epidemic or endemic typhus, by rash clinically as well. Okay? Rickettsia on the wrist and typhus on the trunk. So, the rickettsia start from the wrist and typhus on the trunk. So, rickettsia start peripherally, go centrally, whereas typhus on the trunk, that they start centrally and then can spread out periphery, but they will not go to the palm and soul. So, in this way, we can clinically as well as we can, with the help of what are the tests to diagnose and the treatment of choices, doxycycline, doxycycline and doxycycline. We have an alternative called clomphenicol, but they, are the, they have very severe side effects, so doxycycline is always preferred. If you have any question, you can please ask. I will happy to comment or make another video to answer any question you have. Thank you.